last week we talked about being generous with money. Now I want you to ask yourself, am I generous with my time? Are you willing and and do it lovingly to give time to whatever a person you care about needs from you? Uh, either your kids or your partner or a family member or a friend. Are you generous with your time? Are you willing to do whatever they need to do, uh, need you to do to help them out or to, to spend time with them? I know um, my mother, when she was getting sicker and sicker and the dementia was coming in and she was more um, difficult to be around. I, I saw her mm, probably five or six days a week, but I didn't spend as much time as now I wish I had. I wish I had just sat there and held her hand. Just held her hand, because I know she would have loved that. And thankfully, toward the end of her life, we had this amazing, I mean, they weren't nurses, they were literally angels that came in and spent the time with her that I should have in retrospect, but, you know, um, I wasn't as generous with my time with her as I was with other people in my life, and now I have a regret. So maybe you might want to look at how generous you are with your time, with the people that you care about. You know, if, if you don't want to be involved in a charity organization, don't do it, because you know, there's other ways for you to share your time that make a difference, make a positive impact on other people's lives. And if it's only your circle of friends and acquaintances and family members, fine. That's okay. Generous needs to come from the heart. It can't be out of obligation because then it's not generosity. All right? So just notice that. It's part of having an open heart. And the more open your heart is, the more you're able to give love and receive love. And that's what it's all about. Open that heart wide. And one piece of it is being generous with your time. Just notice how that feels when you ask yourself that question.